What's up, Creepers and Geekers? Chris, the Atari Creep. How is everyone doing today? It is December 1st. The holiday season is officially kicked off, and thus we must do the 30-something days of Creepsmas. No, I'm not going to do a video every day. I just wanted to say a number and days of, you know what I mean? Day of the Dead. That would have worked just as fine, too. Not a holiday kind of guy, but... I figured I'd be a little jolly this year, and periodically throughout the month, for Creepsmas, whatever that is, share some holiday memories with you, and we'll start back with the holiday of 1982, where I was seven years old, and under my tree were these, <laughs> were these, you know what, you could put these two together in any way you'd like, but you know what, that was actually a really great Christmas, E.T. has been one of my favorite franchises, Forever. This is a Holy Grail toy of mine next to an Ad Hat Walker. But this was like, this is, if I got nothing else for the rest of my life, I'm happy with this. But I remember being so excited about getting this because I absolutely loved the movie. We went and saw it so many damn times. And I still, I still choke up whenever I watch E.T. So you have to imagine I was super excited when I found out there was a reunion here on the tubes of you. Now, it's been out for a couple of days. And I, I plan this video for this specific day on purpose. So chances are you've already seen it. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to watch it together. If you've already seen it, you can fast forward to my thoughts at the end. We're not doing a review. Um, or you can just click off if you've already seen it and you don't care either way. But I'm curious. I'm sure you're curious. So let's, let's, let's be curious together and dabble into the, the world of the unknown. Hope the sound levels are good. That's right, kids. Something's coming. It ain't me. Ooh. Yay! <clears throat> well, he looks rough these days, huh? I, you know, I really shouldn't say he looks rough. He looks older. We don't see him too often. That's fucking creepy. <laughs> He's like peekaboo, motherfuckers. You know, I gotta say, digital ET looks better than he does in the uh, special editions that Steven Spielberg put out. Oh, here we are. Ellie, you came back. My son, my family. I right, take that CG CG back. Lots changed since you were here. It's called the internet. <laughs> Reese's Pieces. I still love Reese's Pieces in this day. I'm gonna hit start now, okay? I was just about to say, what do you think E.T.'s playing there? But they showed us. Oh, well. I'm dreaming of a Holiday movies. Having a moment. It's 2019, yo. There ain't no fucking boundaries anymore. Family. Yeah, they're like, did that bitch run off again? <laughs> Why the fuck whenever we come to this blue planet? This guy disappears for three or four days. Sick and tired of it. We're going to leave his ass next time. So Elliot made a shed just like his old one. Put his old bike in there. Was that for old guys like me to tear up? Probably. I'm not going to do it though. Right here. 
I wonder how they got the right to do all this. I should have seen Spielberg put his blessing on it. Oh my god, the kid's gonna explode! Oh, okay. I thought E.T. gave him a blinky, blinky, boom, boom thing. Yeah, it's still on my game. Oh, I want a picture with E.T. Wow, that was cool. That was cool. It wasn't too, um, it wasn't too commercially, um, meaning it wasn't really selling shit. I mean, Xfinity put their cable stuff in there, but that was cool. I dug it, you know? I associate E.T. more with holidays like Christmas and, you know, the like. More so than I do Halloween, which is when the movie actually took place. How weird is that? Maybe because that Christmas I got a shit ton of E.T. stuff. It's funny, one more memory came up. And I don't know if this is necessarily a holiday memory, but it was a Reese's Pieces memory. The packages, if you remember, they came with, during the movie's lifespan, these little uh, cards that had pictures from the movie on it. And it was one of those holographic ones where you twisted it and it would change. I must have bought like 15 or 20 bags of Reese's Pieces over that time period. I got the same fucking one every time. I never, I never got a second or third one. I think there was three or four of them total. Um, maybe I'll do an episode of that, Toys I Wish They Still Had. But, oh, well, yeah, that was pretty cool. That was cool. I think it was done right. It was a fucking almost five minutes long, four and a half minutes long. And they had to cram an entire movie's worth of information in that. I think, I think they did well. I think they did well. I liked it. I liked it a lot. I may watch it again. When the girls get home, I'll make them watch it. Um, but that's really it. So there's my first Creepsmas memory of E.T.'s, uh, we'll call it a finger, and his game that I will let you guys endlessly and needlessly debate down below about. I like it. I like it. It brings back a lot of really good memories, as frustrated as I got before I read the manual. So guys, did you watch this before I did? Of course you did. But let me know down in the comments below what you think of this. What are some of your favorite E.T. memories? Not just holidays. we got a whole month to talk about this shit. So don't be a two-pump chump and fucking blow your load in this video. Save it for another one. And that's really it. Go ahead and leave feedback. Thumbs up, thumbs down. All feedback to the creep is positive. Go Pats! Still undefeated. No, we're not undefeated. We've lost one since then. Strike that. <laughs> We've lost one. But regardless, go Pats. And I hope you have a wonderful rest of your Sunday. We're supposed to be getting fucking bombed with snow. So maybe I'll do another video tomorrow because I'll be snowed in. I don't know. But either way, there will be no Atari Creep Live on Instagram tonight because of the Pats game. And I guess that's all I really have to say. So go ET, go holidays. Tell me some of your favorite ET memories. Thanks as always so much for watching. I'm drooling now. Because my coffee's right there, and it's not in my mouth where it should be. Take care. Creep it real. Let me find my mousey here. And bye-bye.